Wolf, wolf. Bonus three wins due to the generosity of a questionable concede. Stampeding Kodo or Mind Control Tech. Mind Control Tech like very often hits against me, but I don't know if that's because I'm dumb. I'm going to go uh, MCT, I think. Uh, on the basis that it's generally rated higher. Not really anything other than that. Kuki, new tent, wolf, uh, no dragons, so am I going to go after corruption or am I going to go after dreams and hopes? And the answer is corruption. Shadow flame, great AoE, abyssal, that's like the best card, I think, in arena, possibly, like total as in of all the cards. I think it's possible that it is the best card. So we'll pick it. I was just like looking it up to see if that was true. Oh, second Abyssal. Well, uh, yeah. Thanks for hooking me up here on the final runs, Blizzard. I think we go uh, Doppel. Hmm, Azure Drake. Whew. So Doom is a really strong card. And I'm going to pick it. Doom is arguably the strongest card if uh, Abyssal Enforcer wasn't. Demon Wrath. Bartender. Scarab. Our first bad pick. It's okay, we were kind of deal. Uh, Eater of Secrets, Gadgetan Auctioneer, or Spreading Madness. So let's see, spells. I have Corruption, Demon Wrath, Shadow Flame. Six mana, four, four. I don't have any uh, six mana cards yet. Yeah, I guess we'll just go Ox. Crystal Weaver. I think I have only Abyssal and Forces as demons, but four mana, five, four is still best. Uh, huge Toad or Ooze. Ooh, Flame Imp. Hired Gun. Those are good three pickups there. Holy cow. We have the choice of going for... Twisting Nether. There is some amount of board clear that is too many board clear. Or possibly we've even passed it already. But the uh, alternatives are pretty weak. I think we're gonna take the Twisting Nether. Because the two other cards are very bad. Crystal Weaver again. Or Daring Reporter. I have the unfortunate circumstance that I didn't pick up that many uh, demons. I have nine picks left. I have a Flame Imp. I'll go uh, Crystal Weaver. Arcano Smith over the trash. Even though Arcano Smith is trash. I think a Psychotron over Crystal Weaver. I have one, three, four, fours. I have two fives. Psychotron is a nice um, taunt. I think it's my only taunt. Not true. My only good taunt? Not true either. Hired Gun's good. But I'll take Psychotron still. Molten Giant's an interesting consideration. But I'll just take a uh, Thulwark Soul Fiend. Could use the three drop. Coder Rider is uh, quite a bit less good. Garrison Commander. I have one, two, three, four, five, six early game plays already. I think Coder Rider's fine. It's a good card. Closes out the game. Hungry Dragon. Another Corruption. Yep. Kozam. I think I need the two drop. That's a really good pickup. And finally, least but not last, actually the opposite of that, is... Well, that's a pretty cool deck. Very strong Warlock Arena with high quality cards, lots of AoE, and a good curve. So it has it all. It has high quality cards, it has a good curve. And it has so many comeback mechanisms if I do fall behind somehow. Uh, all the mana slots are represented well. Excellent control deck. I'm going to guess 12 wins. Watch your back. Your soul shall be mine!
Ooh, first opponent is golden. I'm all in the wolf since I have corruption. Kano Smith, I think. I also considered Bone Guard Tap. But 0 5 is uh, good against that 2 3. Hmm. Kuki to kill that. Yeah, that's pretty good. No dragons in this deck. I have an Azure Drake. I have Hungry Drake. Whoa. I already have an Abyssal Enforcer, so it's probably better to diversify and get this Dracknid operative. I already have like two AoE in my hand. I was about to take that Abyssal Enforcer. Ooh, ouch. About the seven next turn. My mother does love this face. Bottoms up. Dragging it up is uh, active, taking a good amount of damage. This only works on the single-minded. Don't forget to tip the tauren. Oh, this will again would have been pretty good. All right, give me something good. I needed something uh, less slow than that. I do have a lot of AoE in this deck, so I think I was right not to take Abyssal again. My eyes are open. Dealing three to everything is pretty good here. Azure or Demon Wrath. Oh, Conceal! Wow. Almost. Alright, so my taunts are Hired Gun and Psychotron, and they're probably the best cards I can get now. I think Acidic Swampu's Head Crack is my, uh, Best play here. Maximum violence and all that. I think I'm best off if I actually kill that card. Killing that card is pretty costly. It'd be twisting another. Uh, he actually has a chance to win here. Uh, we're gonna go for this. Give 
It's not really greed because if I had twisting and acidic swamp ooze, I'm not really that much better off. We got there. We are the sword in the shadows. Eight, four. There's very few cards that can top deck to deal four damage to me. I'm gonna go operative and faceless. No, I should do corruption probably. That was uh, that was tough. I almost ran out of health there. That last opponent was really good. He, uh, he did really well with a deck that wasn't very good. That's like especially impressive. Hmm. Well, with both corruptions, I'm encouraged to play it slow. Bone Guard Lieutenant? Mm. Or I could just play with two dead cards. Corruption will be useful later. If he played any card, I was going to corruption it. Talk about a nice suit. Talk about a nice suit. Gadgets and Auctioneer, Coin and Corruption. Interesting. Facing some tough opponents. My opponent has uh, the legendary card back. Very impressive. It's a good card for me to go up against. I mean, not that great. It's a three drop trade. Some good late game stuff. Answer the call of the lights. Let's get we both have so many cards. Powered match. So many. The one thing this deck doesn't have, uh, Blast Crystal Potion, uh, Siphon Soul, etc., is hard removal for stuff. Fire doesn't kill the 6-6. Six, six. Oh, Blast Crystal. Now, freezing? Freezing. Hmm. 
matches. I don't know who's going to win yet, but I should be strongly favored right now. It's possible that the humble Arcano Smith saved me. Possible. Oh, Arcano Smith saved me. Wow. It was bad for him to leave this in the middle, since this is the card I least want to trade off. I was gonna double trade, but the uh, Psychotron does really well against these 3 3s. Technically, Psychotron does kill all three of these 3 3s, and I have Abyssal in case everything. like, in case something goes wrong. Alright. You're about to, uh. Face my true power. Good old Abyssal. That's a good way of closing out the uh, mean streets of gadgets and arenas. With a deck that somehow got two Abyssal Enforcer, it's offered 50% less. Happy New Year. The victory is yours. For Doomhammer, your soul shall be mine. Happy little flame imp lead again. Flame Imp, Bartender, Synergy. If only I could feed the beer to this Soul Fiend. That's interesting. Kooky Chemist is good with the Fell Orc Soul Fiend. If he coins out a 5 health minion. Oh, or that. That uh, allows me to collect the value out of this normally 3-3 three, three with a slight weakness. Alright, the beer has healed me from the flames. This deck is a pretty 
The mind control deck's pretty bad in this deck due to uh, all my board clear. Uh, mind control attack is technically another board clear. Two? Oh. That's fine. If he has Doom Hammer, then rip me. Never lucky. Gadgets and Gazette always gets the scoop. Oh, that's also never lucky. Like a missile here. Balance it had to be done in that order since a uh, wolf would have died to a missile, and there is a tongue. for the salt to flow. I told this guy to stay away from Arena. If only people followed my Twitter. I tweeted out my deck list. I was like, you should stay away from Arena right now. Do they listen? No. They still queue. I think I actually would have missed Lethal if he were uh, at 2. I would have forgotten to copy the Horse Rider there. Alright, so all I have to do is dodge Bloodlust plus 2 damage. If I had uh, done the math and I were at like 14, if I were at 16, I would have tapped and I would have made a mistake because Bloodlust would be lethal. I think this is the best arena that I've uh, managed to pick up over the last, over the entire uh, arena run. Uh, the arena challenge, I mean. Oh, Tonsil, he's lucky him. Here, we need Kodo Rider. Demon Wrath. Probably not. I'm going first. I will be the one knocking. Always Flame Imp. Wow. Pretty good. Hmm, you actually got a good card against Flamen. I could take the trade, but the 2-2 two -two is a better trade. In the light's name. Oh! Oh, that, uh, that was nice.
pretty good. It's pretty back and forth so far. Uh, let's protect the wolf. Good shadow or pain target. Okay. The reason to attack there is because the 4 1 is good to attack into other stuff. And I can't uh, use the 4 to attack both that and something else. So you got exactly the. Po no, it's not the polymorph potion all the time. I want this one. And this is a good card for this to trade into. Interesting. I was gonna go Psychotron, but... I got the best it's time for Doom. Or can we do better than that? Bissell is pretty better. Both Warlock and Warlocks uh, have had both sides drop in so much health. It's kind of dangerous. It's the Psychotron Corruption combo again. <laughs> And I have the chemist uh, Felwork Sulfine combo again. Total corruption, total power. Nice. Draws have been uh, pretty gross. Flame Imp begins in your opening hand. Up against a Golden Warlock with the Legend card back. I have no fear. Bring them all on. Miss, miss, yes. <laughs> I need all the luck I can get, right? Ooh, that curve. This curve, admittedly, is kind of unfortunate. Spell damage hurts me here. Oh. 
I'm not gonna use Demon Wrath to kill that. I'll go ahead and play a War Coda. Play Auctioneer. I, got the best deals anywhere. I didn't really need to tap, so Crystal Weaver tap isn't very good. You on the list? Pretty good. He was really afraid of Auctioneer. This totally should be a demon. But it's a fell orc. Which is really not the same thing. I'd love to get better Abyssal Valley, but it's fine. Just for me? I wow! Oh man! I was thinking about like what to do. I would have to clear the North Sea Kraken and it looked kind of tough to do so. I'm glad I hit the face there. Carrier, more of a late game card. Toss. Need to get that flame imp. Ooh, where, where's the flame imp? Don't forget to tip your torrin. Felric Sophine is really good against two attack minion since it has the potential to get an extra attack out of it. That thing is dead anyways. I think I should be using Shadow Flame here. <laughs> Seven damage Frostbolt. I have enough AoE. So I plan on summoning uh, three minions next turn. I'll make that a four or five. Abyssal next turn. Probably still write the trade into the 3 3. Oh, and then I have to choose between tap and ooze. I've got enough late game to not need to tap here. I thought about killing the 3 5. 
to wound it. But I think with the spare two health guys, I have the spare three health guys, uh, three attack guys should be fun. And this uh, three two is useful in dealing with his next card. Yeah, that works. Abyssal into a uh, Kodo Tap. Good stuff. So far, very few people have Wanted. had to see my true form yet. The Spellslinger card wants to target one of his own minions, implying it's a buff. I am not a morning person. And then he chose not to. If he could have buffed by two, wouldn't he have done it so he could kill Kodo Rider? Hmm. I thought about Demon Wrath for a long time. I also thought about Abyssal, but I think uh, my board is good enough. It stands by itself. Ooh. Fortunately, Deal 4 to all clears his own board, uh, if he got it, and I'll be left with a 3-5. And he would have chosen Deal 4 to all. He doesn't have it. He also would have uh, preferred to deal 5 damage to something. She also didn't do. So we're narrowing down the possibilities. It leads me to think that I have no idea what he got. I got the best deals anywhere. Hand. All AoE. This board. Monstrous. Oh, he got a 10 drop. The madman. Wow. Okay. Deal 6 to all wouldn't have been enough, so he needed bad sheep. Flip it. Flip that board, yeah. Now you see my true power. He finally played all his AoE. Just kidding. Kicking, I see. I think I want a Hungry Dragon and then Demon Wrath. A 
extraordinary. Amazing. All right, just teasing. You have no chance. Yuck! 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 yuck. Been holding that card for a while. It's probably a spell. Um, I might actually lose. <laughs> Direwolf Alpha is really good for me right now. Fireball would kill me in time anyway, so I'm just gonna tap. No, I'm not gonna tap. I'm gonna go uh, three drop, three drop, four drop. Or five drop, two drop. Uh. Where's my Psychotron when I need him? Alright, so we need Taunt. Uh, taunt? Taunt for the win! I got Kazakis off of Cabal Carrier. I'll blame that for the loss. I didn't realize that I could play the two Demon Wrath on a turn that I went twisting another. That would have uh, actually been uh, better. Oops. Flame Imp, why have you forsaken me? only that Deathwing turn I had my usual uh, Psychotron Corruption combo. should have chemist my guy into a 3-5. That was a misplay. I guess I deserve to lose for that one. Oh, dang. Disaster catastrophe. That was the play. That was such a slow tempo turn for me. Megatron's actually doing pretty well here. Oh, wow. Oh! The humanity. is back.
think we don't trade. Yeah. This guy uh, trades with Mad Bomber in theory. Not bad. Pretty good, actually. The trade is good, but the no trade is also good. Oh, punish? Didn't expect for him to be able to deal with both of them. Interesting. We went after that one over the 2-3. Oh, I see. Bottoms up. It would have hurt him a lot if he had gone after the 2-3 uh, there. Uh, as I would have lethal. I don't like this place. <laughs> cool. We've had some tough opponents. For Doomhammer, your soul shall be mine. Not being a twisted worgen instead of a uh, worgen infiltrator is such a big deal, since he had to use the coin. Interesting that he would coin out a teardrop and then follow it up with a hero power. That's kind of weird. Wow! Did he think that card was like way scarier than it actually was or something? He's like, whoa, a 3 7. Gotta kill that. <coughs> That's like the same as devolving um, a 3 3, basically. Alright, well, this might be our first not great opponent. Maybe. That devolved play, that was something. In case of taunt. Wow. 
manipulate the coder rider. And then we have a stampede. <clears throat> I need to cast a Crystal Weaver, but I'm sure we can get it. How exciting. <clears throat> my first Kazakus in Arena, I think. I think this is my first one. Kazakus active. My only regret is I'm too far ahead, so I won't need Kazakus. This guy looks like he's got a pretty solid Jade deck. I think I want the 5 drop for a random polymorph. Nice. Oh wait, I don't actually have the means of isolating that card. And polymorph is still probably best. 5 damage? Draw 2. Didn't do very well on that turn. Let's negotiate. You can see. And I'll let you live. But I did well enough, I think. Serve or die. Oh. Alright, fine. I really feel like Reno Lock right now. I feel like he's playing Jade. I definitely didn't play as well as I could. The Kazakus push in choice. Um, wow. Whoa! They got all taunt plus corruption combo. Drawing two cards uh, off of Kazakus ended up not very good. Ow.
only I didn't draw two cards of Kazakus. I think I uh, will play the try to kill him before fatigue kicks in game. Yeah, that's a really good turn for me. next turn. I'm going to take three next turn, so if he hits me with all of it, I lose. So therefore I have to trade at least one off. I lost from the Kazakus potion yeah. kick. Did I get too overconfident because my deck was insane? I had no idea I'd face uh, three decks that good. So to win the game, I need him to draw two useless cards. Because this thing needs to connect with face twice. Take three and then four. So that's gonna... Unfortunately be it for me. Maybe I'll concede. <laughs> oh. Wow. I think this deck could have gone 12 wins. Um, could have. This game I misplayed. I did misplay one of the earlier games, and then one of the games I drew really poorly. The game I misplayed also drew poorly, but possibly I could have come back from it. That early game, when he played the Devolve, I was like, oh, of course I'm going to win. Wow. That was a really good duck. And he got Twisting Nether. And yet, I could have played well enough to beat him. That's, uh, that's unfortunate.